veteran players to play in three anyway, but if we could four games just to, you know, we're, we're in a learning process here, and I think the best way to, you know, to get out there and really understand it is to play in the game, so I, I think it's important that they play, they want to play as opposed to practicing, so um, tonight had a little bit more of a veteran feel to it, but still certainly there were some young players in there, and you know, Beck and Watson, Fiala, Forsberg, uh, Pascula, Alm, still some young players that were evaluating there, and I thought they handled themselves pretty good. So, you know, if, 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 he, if he were to find his way in a, on a line like he did tonight, he's going to he's gonna regularly be against a lot of the top players that he's playing against. So you need a player that's smart defensively and can read the game and, um, you know, handle those situations. He was, I thought he was steady again tonight. He's had a had a good camp so far, and um, you know we'll continue to look at him in all situations: power play, penalty kill, uh, different different players that, that you know possibly he can fit in, and, uh, those type of roles. We're, we're again we're trying to find pieces. We're trying to build a team, and and not necessarily a top line. And that's kind of how we're looking at it. We want to be strong um, with 23 men, and um, so we're we're looking at. To, we're building the lines, there's positions that are available and open. I think Phillips came uh, was strong in the rookie tournament. You know, he left there for me as our, our most impressive forward, and uh, he's come to our camp. He's followed it up in practices and, and, uh, and now two exhibition games.